What's up? My name is Techno, but here for Troubleshoot and welcome back to another video. In this quick video, I'll be running through some solutions that you can try if you're not able to boot into PUBG, as in you're stuck in some kind of loading screen. While this is usually a server related issue or internet connection related issue, if you're not experiencing issues in other online games, web browsing, etc., it could be PUBG's servers. It's a good idea to check Twitter and sites like to find out if you're alone. If your friends are playing fine, for instance, it could be you. There's a couple of solutions that we can try, starting from the most simple. First of all, update Windows through Windows Update as you would normally, and download the latest update for your graphics card, either through official software such as GeForce Experience or off of NVIDIA or AMD's website. When that's done, restart your computer and see if you're able to play the game again. If you're not, there's another fix that we can try by clearing the game's settings. This is relatively simple to pull off. First of all, hit Control Shift and Escape to bring up the Windows Task Manager. And inside of here, all you're gonna have to do is look for Player Unknown's Battlegrounds or PUBG. Simply make sure that if you find the process running, right click it and then click End. When you've closed PUBG completely, simply hold Start and press R to bring up this box over here. In here, we'll be typing percentage local app data percentage backslash TSL and we'll click on TSL game. Then click OK and a new file browser should open up in PUBG's local app data folder, the TSL game folder. Open saved, then config, Windows no editor. Inside of here, we're looking for game user settings.ini. Either you can delete this file, which will let all of your settings refresh from scratch, or if changing game settings cause this issue, simply click view at the very top and make sure file name extensions is ticked. On Windows 11, the steps are a little bit different for this. Look for the ini.backup file over here and simply remove .backup. Then yes, when you're prompted whether you'd like to change it, and you should be running the previous settings that you had for the game. This way, any setting changes that you've made that caused the game to break will now be undone. If you try this and it doesn't work, simply delete that file completely so the game user settings will regenerate from scratch. Now head across to Steam, simply search for PUBG, right click, then click Properties, and inside of this window here, on the Local Files tab, make sure to verify integrity of game files. This will run through all of the game's files on your computer, and if anything seems to be broken or different to the latest version on the server, it'll download updates and fix the files on your computer. When that's done, fire up the game and see if things are working properly. If you're able to log in, awesome. If you're still having issues, however, another solution I've heard of is moving this to a faster drive. Of course, this isn't going to be applicable to everyone, but if you have a fast SSD in your computer, you can move games without having to re-download them by right-clicking it, clicking Properties, then Local Files, and choosing Move Install Folder. As long as you have a Steam library selected on a different drive here, you'll be able to move it rather easily. The game's located on E, so I have C drive, my NVMe, and my A drive, a large hard drive. Of course, you'll be moving it to the faster of whatever other drives you have in your computer, if any. But anyways, that's really about it. It usually comes down to server issues rather than issues you could be having yourself, meaning this issue will probably go away with a bit of time. Thank you all for watching. My name's been Techno, here for Troubleshoot, and I'll see you all next time. Ciao.